T minus 15 seconds. Falcon 9, configure to the flight. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and 0. And the liftoff of the Falcon 9 rocket and the Dragon spacecraft packed with science and supplies for the International Space Station, humanity's home in low Earth orbit. And the Falcon 9 has cleared the tower. SpaceX ascent commentary is performed by several people. The propulsion Vehicle engineer calls damage. out propulsion events. Vehicle avionics control. engineer calls out avionics health and dragon separation. The range coordinator calls Air Force satellite control network acquisition and loss of signal. And the ground station specialist calls out the SpaceX antenna acquisition and loss of signal. Second stage engine chill. chill has begun. Around two minutes, 35 seconds into flight, the nine Merlin engines will sequentially shut down. You'll hear the term MECO, which means main, which main engine cutoff. And we have Miko. Stage separation confirmed. And back ignition. And we have ignition of the second stage Merlin engine. This is a six and a half minute burn that brings Dragon into low Earth orbit. This engine produces 210,000 pounds of thrust. Stage trajectory nominal. Dragon separation confirmed. And we have confirmation of dragon separation. You can see this shot on your screen now. Inside the trunk, you can see some unpressurized cargo that will be making its way to the space station. And we are standing by for a visual confirmation of Solaroid deploy. And there you have it. Dragon is in its array of deployed state. The solar arrays of the Dragon being deployed. It's a signal at New Hampshire as expected.
And as the Dragon unfurls its solar wings, the spacecraft will continue on its journey to the International Space Station. The Dragon will arrive at the space station on Wednesday, April 4th. NASA television coverage begins at 5.30 a.m. Eastern, following at 8.30 a.m. Eastern with installation, which will be ground controlled by robotic flight controllers in Mission Control at Houston. Norshige Kanai is the prime for grapple, backed up by astronaut Scott Tingle of NASA. Ricky Arnold will monitor the Dragon systems during the final approach.